Today, we are showing how to fix no heat problem for electrical dryer. The problem is not the motor. Motor runs, but there's no heat. The first thing we need to test whether there's a power here, outlet. There are three of them. And you need to test whether there's a, a 220, uh, 110. And then we test this is OK. And then we plug it in this um, back and then follow this wire and come to this terminal. The terminal is supposed to be, there are 220 between those two. Between those two, it's a 100 ton. Between those two, 100 ton again. If everything is fine, then you have to disconnect this. Remember, I don't, if this is a safety, safety, disconnect this. So there's no electricity that on this you can work on that safely. And then once you are disconnected, you come to the front. Remember, this is a Kim or earlier version. You can't open the back. You have, you may have seen a lot of video. They open the back. This one, you cannot open the back. You have to open the front. The way to open the front is you press this down, open this side, and press this down, open this side, and remove this panel. Once the panel is removed, you are going to see there's a heating coil. And heating coil is, is in this um, part, and the way to take it out is you have to use um, and take this screw. There's a screw on the side and take it out. The way I take it out, I use this one to take it out. So once you manage to take the screw out, this will uh, slide out easily. So remember, there is only take one screw. So this is the heating coil. So you examine the heating coil. Uh, this side it looks fine. There's no problem, but here you see this side has a problem. If this is broken, that's why there's no heat. The way to fix it is you either replace this and find uh, Kim Moore has a part number. You would have to find a part. This particular part is part number three three eight seven seven four seven. You either go. Remember when you connect it, you only can connect some parts if you really 